So in a way, we are so predictable. We get one, two, three, four, five, six experiences, let's say. Some of them, they have a bigger impact on us. Mm -hmm. Some of them, they become a childhood trauma. Mm -hmm. Some of them, they become complex PTSD. Mm -hmm. And some of them, they excruciate us so painfully and so strong and we somatize them so well in our nervous system, mm. then we start believing that life from now on is going to be like that, only like that. And then everything that comes towards us, oh, I, I never go there. So yes, you yes. block yourself. It, it, uh, yeah, I think uh, you say it correctly, but there is a little bit more than that. Um, life is totally unpredictable. The only thing consistent in life is inconsistency. It's, it's, it's clear, yeah? But the, the, our mind, our mind, uh, people don't know what the mind is, and nobody will ever know. Our mind is energy. It's only energy. And this energy is the energy that moves between the cells. This is the mind, actually. I know I'm making it so simple. It's, it's not as simple as that. This energy has been circulating in our brain and body inside on us and between us. It's moving in a certain way and built up, uh, as I said, a map of life, yes? And the mind, and you can call it the ego, you can call it many things, wants things to stay exactly as it was. Because uh, the familiarity, the known, is where our safety is. So what you said about difficult things in life, they are difficult, they are painful, but they are safe. Because this is what we know. If, you, if anybody wants to be free, they must jump to the unknown. Totally. If we learned from our mistakes, we, if you learn from mistakes, if I learn my mistakes, I will be genius by now. You understand? But we don't. We do it again and again because this is where we gravitated towards safety in unsafety. You see? That's where we are.